Hey everybody. Well, we've got something a little different for you to do this week in order to improve your strength and flexibility. We're going to get a partner. So grab your mom, your dad, your brother, your sister, and let's learn how to do some really cool cooperative exercises. Remember, anytime that you're starting to do any of these, you want to go into them very, very, very slowly. You want to breathe through them and you want to help your partner to be successful. The only way that you guys can get these done and do them right and have fun is to encourage each other and make sure that you're safe. Here's the first one, your sitting bridge. All right, here's the next one. You want to start out super tall back to back and then gradually walk those feet out. Eventually, you want to try to get to a 90 degree angle at the legs, but if you can't, that's okay. You go as far out as you can, making sure that you're both staying safe and pushing gently on each other's back. Keep your back nice and straight. Ah, you guys mastered this a couple of weeks ago. The tree pose. Now it's a great opportunity to grab a family member and welcome them into your forest and you can be trees together. There's a bunch of different variations on how to do this. You pick out which one that you wanna do with your partner. The cooperative fold, what an excellent back and shoulder stretch. Notice how they are going halfway down into their fold and they're holding it. Their back is flat as a pancake. I hope I get some pictures of you and your family doing these. I would love to see them. Uh, another excellent back stretch, the resting child's pose. Remember, try to hold these positions for at least 10 to 15 seconds in order to get a really good stretch. And always switch positions. So the girl that's leaning back will eventually fold forward into the child's pose and the girl on the right will lean back into the resting pose. This looks like a lot of fun. What an excellent stretch for the whole body, the peekaboo. You wanna make sure when you bend down and you reach for your partner, you should feel a pull, not a pain. Never do these exercises and feel pain. These are stretching exercises to improve your flexibility. So once you feel that pull, that's when you want to stop. This is a more advanced pose. Make sure that when you try this, you have parent supervision, you have a clear open area, and you go in really, really slow. The person on the bottom will get the person on the top in position and gently lift them up. Again, make sure you have parent supervision, you have a safe area to do this. Maybe on the grass would be a great spot. It'd be a good idea to have a spotter, just somebody to make sure that the person on the top flying is safe. All right, well, I hope you enjoy these cooperative poses and stretches this week. Please make sure you post under the assignments, pictures of you and your family working cooperatively and having fun.